Hey guys, I'm here on Liberty Island, and this is the Statue of Liberty. Let me tell you all about it. Welcome to Ryan's World. Oh, I'll take it from here, Ryan. This is the Statue of Liberty, one of the most famous landmarks in the world. It's located in New York City on Liberty Island, now known as New York Harbor. Oh, wow! The monument is so big! Exactly how big is it? The Statue of Liberty is 151 feet tall and weighs over 450,000 pounds. And that's not including the pedestal. That's tall and heavy! I'm not even five feet tall! And an average car weighs 4,000 pounds! So, that means the Statue of Liberty weighs as much as 112 cars! But where did the Statue of Liberty come from? And what is it doing in the New York Harbor? The Statue of Liberty was a gift to the United States from France in 1886. The statue was modeled after a Roman goddess of freedom named Libertas. That means the Statue of Liberty stands for freedom. Freedom! I like that! I wish I had the freedom to play as much video games as I want! Combination Panda! I don't think so! Just kidding, Mom! <laughs> See her spiky crown on her head? It has seven points to represent seven continents and seven seas of the Earth. This shows the idea that liberty or freedom is universal and is to be shared all over the world. She's also holding a flaming torch covered in gold leaf above her right hand. The torch also stands for freedom. In her other hand, she's holding a stone tablet or a book of laws. It reads July 4th, 1776 in Roman numerals. That's the year the Declaration of Independence was signed. This helped lead the 13 U.S. colonies to freedom. She is also stepping over a broken chain, which is another symbol for freedom. Combo Bunga! Everything about the Statue of Liberty represents freedom. But what is she made out of? The Statue of Liberty is made out of copper. Did you say copper? Like how the US penny has copper. Wait a minute. Then why is the Statue of Liberty green? It doesn't look like the penny's color at all. Good observation, Combo. You see, over time, water and air turn copper green. Here's what the Statue of Liberty looked like when it was first completed. It was brown. However, slowly, over 30 years of standing out in the sun and rain, it turned green, the color you see today. So, if the Statue of Liberty was built in France, how did it get to America? I guess she could have taken a really big airplane. The statue was completed in Paris, France, but it was really big, so it had to be taken apart. Then, once all the parts were shipped to the USA, they had to rebuild it. The Statue of Liberty was dedicated on October 28th 1886. Thanks, Peck! I learned so much about the Statue of Liberty! Now let's recap to see if I got this right. Combo recap! The Statue of Liberty is located in New York City, and it's a symbol of freedom! It was made in Paris, France, and they gifted the statue to America in 1886. The Statue of Liberty is made out of copper, but over time, it turned green because of the air and water. That's right, Combo. Now, let's get back to Ryan. I hope you had fun learning the Statue of Liberty with me. Bye. Remember, always stay happy and rise up. Bye.